That's me, right here. Oh, what's this? Hey guys, Token Vaping. Um, so today's juice review is on a flavor from, if you recognize this, Milk Stash E-Liquids. It's actually kind of cool. Um, and yes, this is the bottles they come in. These are really, really cool. They are 60 mil Chubby Gorilla Unicorn bottles. Um, they're really durable plastic so you don't have to worry about it but huge cap with a safety ring on it here um, their cute little logo which is a, a mustache obviously with milk dripping off of it hence milk stash um, there is three flavors in the line so I will do a separate video on each flavor they all have different style mustaches as well as names this one is outlaw now it is a boba milk tea um, anybody who has ever had like boba tea yeah, it's that Asian style uh, milky uh, milky drink that has the um, the big balls of uh, I just totally drew a blank it'll come to me but if you know what boba tea is you you basically you know what the, you know what I'm talking about um, there's the name of the company right in here there is the mustache with the name and then it has all the warning and uh, ingredient label and barcode on here as well and like I said huge safety ring and this is definitely a lot first vape first review is what this is for now they do have a website it's um, milk stashy liquid uh, basically it's milk stash liquid dot com um, and they have all of the information that you need on uh, the different flavors uh, profiles pricing um, contact points for them as well they are all over social media. I mean, they've got some big names repping them too. So, I mean, as long as you follow um, Instagram, Facebook, uh, Google+, Pinterest, uh, tweeting, um, they are all over the place. So, definitely check them out. Definitely, uh, you know, look up their different pages and, uh, you know, take a look, see what you find. And uh, the three flavors is a boba tea, a pistachio milk, and... Uh, almond milk and I'm looking forward to the almond milk because I, I actually like the taste of that one so that will be in a future video um, these are offered in 0, 3, and 6 uh, nicotine according to the website and like I said they are 60 mil um, chubby gorilla unicorn bottles so we're just gonna jump right in and go on to a flavor profile now I've never been a big fan of the actual boba tea um, I have tried it before. I have tried it in different flavors. Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is specifically. I don't know if it's a texture thing. I don't know if it's a uh, just a flavor specifics that it just never hit me. So I actually have high hopes to try this because I've heard a lot about this line just in general. So um, we're going to go ahead and pop this open and I will be working it on my device here. Brand new cotton as always for my review. And the cotton that I use is Texas Tough Cotton. Uh, really, really solid wicking cotton. Easy to use. Very durable. Holds flavor really well. Doesn't have a really strong cottony taste even on a first vape. So on Instagram, it's Texas Tough Cotton if you are interested. So I'm going to go ahead and we're going to bust this open. And if you listen, that crack right there is pretty much... And then it comes into that. Now, how cool is that? It's deceiving because you have a big, huge, monstrous cap like this, and you're thinking, holy crap, that's going to be a really big tip. Take that off, and it's just a really small, thin nozzle, which is really easy to work with. So that's really awesome. So we're going to go ahead and juice this up. And see, as here, I mean, it makes it just really simple to work in into your cotton and everything else without making a huge mess. So that's really, really cool from Milk Stash. Um, but, you know, in reference to the gigantic cap that comes on it with the big old safety ring that locks into place, anytime you get something that has, you know, a safety feature on it, whether it's a ring, a cap, a wrap, a seal, lid, whatever, you know, just make sure that if anything about it makes you feel uncomfortable or makes you unsure about it and you're not, you don't feel safe about doing it, um, just don't use it you know contact where you got it from contact who makes it contact who distributes it let them know what's going on so that they can figure out what happened and take steps to rectify the situation and get you a product in its proper and 100 percent form 
and then in, to ensure also that they look into it and make sure that it was whether it was a fluke or not um, to ensure that it does not uh, repeat itself for somebody else because at the end of the day regardless of anything it's all about your health and safety so that's what's most important so we're gonna go ahead and wake this up and real fast while I'm finishing this no matter what it's just basically my opinion as far as to um, you know how the flavor hits me and what I think of the flavor and how I take to the vape um, I'm not trying to impose my will on anybody I'm not trying to instill my opinion into a, another person and tell them that that's how they should take to it that's not me I'm just trying to give you a more informed base to go off of so that it gives you a little bit more to help you decide whether or not it's something you want to try for yourself if it's something you want to try to bring into your shop for it to sample things like that so you know ultimately just take it for what it is you know and just understand that I'm not trying to force it on anybody so I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick pre-burn on this go ahead and juice up a little bit more and we'll hopefully get this up and running cap this up and as always vaping at 75 watts so this is outlaw from milk stashy liquids it's uh, their boba milk tea That has a very interesting taste. So I'm going to drip a little bit more. As you can see, the clouds are really solid. Now, I wasn't specifically sure, because um, it doesn't state it that I can find, as far as what the exact uh, mix ratio is. I will find out after this video so that I can notate the video and I will also make sure that it is listed on my other two videos as well. I will actually make sure that I find out. Um, okay. So, again, if you've ever had a boba tea, um, it definitely has that tea flavor to that, especially mostly on the aftertaste. That's where it hits me the most is on the tail end and on the exhale. It definitely has a tea flavor. It has a, a very milky, kind of a sweet overall taste to the vape. Um, where the Well, obviously the milk part is going to be for the milk stash. Um, all three flavors are based around, you know, a milky flavor. So you definitely get the milk creaminess of it. Um, like I said, there is a slight bit of sweetness that actually accents um, the the cream aspect of it, and then the tail end of it is going to be uh, the tea the tea aspect of it. So it it definitely is a unique flavor. I will say that, as I had stated, I'm not a fan of boba tea. So this probably out of the three, this probably would be. Uh, the last one that I would choose out of the other three. Um, however, compared to the boba teas that I have tried, this is actually a very, a much more enjoyable taste for me than the actual tea itself. Um, so in a way, I, I am kind of trying to give it a good thing. Um, but like I said, it's not a flavor that I would definitely, um, I would definitely uh, jump on and say is my number one out of the out of the line, uh, which is why I actually wanted to try it first. So, um, you know, like I said, the flavor is pretty solid. It does have a sweet creaminess to it. It does have the tea exhale. Now, 
For me, because it has more of that tea flavor, I do feel a little bit more of a throat hit. Um, and as far as going by, you know, the consistency of the fluid, I'm going to guess it to be at about a 70-30. Now, like I said, I will find out for sure. I'll contact the company directly and ask them to find out. But that would be my guess. The clouds are really solid for it, um, so that's really good. But that comes with the creaminess aspect as well. Um, but it's not, it's not as thick as... I've seen most normal 80-20s, you know, it does have a bit of fluidness to it. So I'm going to guess it to be at about a 70-30. Now because of that, and because it is a lighter flavor and a lighter vape um, with the tea aspect, I do feel a bit of a throat hit. Now it's not a deal breaker in general, it's not a harsh one, it's not, um, it's not a super scratchy on my throat, but it definitely is there. And again, that's something that I'm not a fan of just because I prefer the thicker vapes um, and the more smoother ones, so I don't feel it as much. So overall you know on a scale of one to ten if if, I, if i'm doing this in token levels um for right now i would probably put this at roughly at about six tokens um it's more of a uh enjoyment if you like the actual boba tea flavor if you're not a fan of it i would definitely say try it because it's definitely going to be a little different but if you're not a fan of the flavor like myself, it's probably not going to be um, your your first choice. However, regardless of anything else, you know, it still is a privilege to be able to do the review for this flavor. So Milk Stash, milk stash Liquids, thank you guys so very much. It's, it's a privilege and an honor regardless. Like I said, great company. Um, really big on social media. They are all over the place. It's really hard for you to say that you don't know how to find them. Um, and like, they, like I said, they've got a lot of, a lot of good big name people that are repping their their brand as well so it definitely says a lot about them um but still a huge privilege keep an eye out for my other videos on the other two flavors i definitely will be looking forward to trying them as well as always guys i'm token vaping here on youtube facebook instagram snapchat pinterest um definitely hit me up if there's anything specific that you're wanting to know about anything of concerning vaping, um, any type of video that you'd like to, uh, to see me do for you, um, anything that I can do to help enhance your vaping experience. That really is the only reason why I choose to do this. That's why I want to do this. So definitely let me know. I will do everything I can to uh, accommodate any requests that I do, I do come across. Milk Stash Liquids, thank you guys very much. Vapers, Token Vaping, Vape On, Vape Strong. Have a good night.